Hi. Wait for some people to join. I have a lot of stuff to talk about today. <laughs> We're down in the living room uh, to see how that goes, but you know, we'll see how that, how that works for us. Um, if you click through on the side, you can sort of see um, everything to talk about. Um, and let me just start with not really a gift that you would give someone. It's just, it's a gift that you give yourself. Okay. <laughs> Let's be real. Um, we have holiday parties to go to. Um, sometimes you need shapewear and your girl needs shapewear. So this is from item M6. Um, I really like it. It's just really like, it's really comfortable. And if you're like me, you've tried a lot of different kinds of shapewear and you're like, nothing kind of works. This one is really comfortable. It's really nice, but you still feel like it's doing something for you. Obviously I'm not gonna wear it. Um, but if you look here, it's got like a nice, I don't know what you would call that. I wanna say ruching, maybe that's ruching. Ruching on the butt, it has snaps here. And then you can also kind of do the, the straps um, cross or uh, just regular straps. And then I just find it's really nice, you know, so it has a little built-in bra thing and all the shapewear components. So I really like it, really recommend you get it. Um, any sort of events you're going to, especially if you like holiday parties, like you're wearing a lot of like, you know, maybe like a long sleeve, like velvet thing or like sequins or something like that. Like, this is really helpful for that. This is like, just gonna like, smooth out everything and like be very comfortable um all night long that's that's all i have to say that's all i have to say about that i think it's really good it's a really good deal really good price especially in the in this live um with the deal that you get when it's in the live and uh i really like it i always do that clicking thing i just can't it's like i literally can't i can't stop myself i can't do it okay Let's go to these. Um, this is really, I think this is a really good gift. Sort of like, it's sort of like a housewarming gift. Maybe someone just moved into a new place. Um, it's just like a nice standard, like who doesn't need containers, like sort of canisters of any kind. Um, so these are by Hawkins, New York. It's three. I literally use these. So these are filled with stuff. <laughs> So don't be alarmed. There's macaroni in here. Um, <laughs> so these are nice. They just sit out on the counter. Um, they're pretty enough to sit out on the counter, which I really like. And then there's three different sizes. So this is the biggest one. And then this is kind of the medium one. Let's see what's in that. It's more macaroni. I'm not joking. Um, <laughs> and then here's the small one. This one has rice. <laughs> Um, but I just think they're a really nice sort of easy, easy thing to have store dried goods in them. And I, uh, I really like them. I think they're like cute enough to have out and pretty inexpensive, like a pretty good deal. And I've had these for like a year. Um, they work really well. They're like, I don't know. I don't know what else I could want. What more I could want. I really like these really recommend um snagging some of these they're just really nice i'm not i don't know why i'm trying to hold all three of them at once like a like a lunatic um <laughs> let me put down some of these see a lot of this stuff is kitchen items but my kitchen is not it's not really like um aesthetically pleasing so i wanted to give you this background of like the fireplace <laughs> the kitchen is right i'm staring at it um but these are usually just out um on my counter they're just like a lightweight um container i really like them i just think they're really helpful i think these would make a great gift i don't know if that's stupid if that's like weird <laughs> i don't know if that's silly but like i feel like i would like these as a gift um because i find them really useful and it's like you always need like a little container and if it's a little pretty container that you can store out all the better to me as far as i know as far as I can tell. I have a lot of like random, I have like different stuff going on in this one. I just like, there was like a lot of stuff that I felt really passionate about. 
talk about. And so I just sort of added everything. Um, so maybe we'll stay in the home world um, and I'll just go to my next thing, which is kind of a new purchase of mine, but I really, really like them. Look at this. They're so cute. Okay. Again, just like the storage containers, I'm like, who doesn't need these? This is like the prettiest gift. I mean, obviously, I know that I am preconditioned to like rainbow things. I love, I find it very satisfying. I find a lot of color very satisfying, but like, look at how pretty this is. And I've used these, you know, like I've used them, I've washed them, I put them back in this thing and they just like, it's so nice that they nest. Is this another thing that I also leave out on my counter? Yes. Um, I just, I think it's really nice. It's always useful to have like a set of bowls, um, especially just different mixing bowls of various sizes. Um, you know, Kirsty, I should have looked up if it was dishwasher safe because I, um, I wasn't sure and I've been washing them by hand. Let me see if I can figure it out for you. Oh, I can't hang on. Nope. I can't, I can't figure it out. I can't go read it. I thought I could. Um, but look, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bowls. Oh, it says that right there. I'm not smart. Um, yeah, I ended up washing these by hand, um, but I'm not sure. They're like, kind of sound like the same um, material as the other containers, where it's just kind of like a lightweight um, situation. The biggest one is like pretty big, um, which I really like. I'm like, I could put it on my head. Um, oh, sorry, you're asking a real question. It doesn't have rubber on the bottom, no. Um, but it doesn't really, um, it doesn't really slide on the counter. Um, let me see if I can test that out for you somewhere. I'm like, it doesn't like, it doesn't, it slides, but it doesn't like slide around on the counter, if that makes any sense. But there's no, um, there's no rubber on the bottom. So if you are specifically looking for something like that, this isn't going to be the bowl for you. Um, because it is a little, um, it does move around. Um, but I, I haven't noticed it to be a problem. Um, you could also store these away. I just think they're so pretty that I leave them out. They are dishwasher safe. Kirsty came in to help me. Thank you. <laughs> so now I don't have to keep hand washing them. I don't know why I just was like, I better hand wash these instead. Um, but I just, I just think these are really pretty, man. Um, as Kirsty pointed out, there's also like a black and gray, um, set. I just, if there's a color option, I'm always going to pick that. And like, it's just so, it's just so satisfying. It's like, what else do I want out of life? Except a set of rainbow bowls. I don't know what else I would want. It'd just be crazy. Um, I really recommend these, especially like, I don't know if other people are like this with the holidays, but like, I like cooking, but I like really like baking. I know Kirstie's a big baker. Uh, <laughs> I'm not as fancy as Kirstie, but um, I do like baking and I like cooking stuff for the holidays and trying new recipes and stuff like that. And like, it's just really helpful when you have this variety of sizes of bowls just sort of at your disposal. So I'm constantly like using these, like I just have them sitting out on my counter. I said that before, um, a few new people have joined. Um, and I just always just kind of use them, um, just for random stuff as you're going around. Um, it's very helpful. Um, as I said, I have too much stuff to get through. So let's keep going. I'm going to stay, I'm going to stay in our, I'm going to stay in our home world. This is the thing that I love the most. I, it's, it's no offense to everything else. It also is weird because I am standing in my living room. I don't usually keep the toaster in the living room, but I wanted to bring it out to show it to you guys. Um, this is the Smeg um, four slice toaster. It's um, it's not really showing the color correctly here. It really is more akin to what you see in the picture where it's a mint green. It's looking, it's showing up a little blue on camera, but it really is that like really pretty, like retro-y, like mint green. Um, it's just like a really solid toaster. I've had a lot of toasters where, you know, you spend like 40 bucks on it and you're like, no, oh, this is fine. 
like, you know, the toaster that you had in college or whatever, um, once you stop using the dining hall. And um, they're just not as good. And I'm not telling you that you have to spend $200 on a toaster. I'm just telling you, if you want to, I really recommend it. Um, the fun thing about this, first of all, I find that it's really easy. It's really nice to use four pieces of toast in the thing. Let's get that out of the way. Secondly, it's really easy to clean the bottom of it. Like you just pull this thing out and then this is where the crumb catcher, this is where all the crumbs go. You can just dump it out. I did it right before so you wouldn't think I was gross. And then there's just the adjustment knob here. And then the best part about this toaster, I think, is that it really like, when the toast is done, it like pops. Like it's like old school, like pops the toast out. And I just find it really satisfying and amusing. I'm just like, man, that's really fun. Like I like make, my son is like a little over a year and a half and I'll like make toast for him and then be like, do you want to watch this? <laughs> and then it's just like, bing. Uh, it's very, 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 very satisfying. I'm a big fan of this toaster specifically. This is the only Smeg product I have. Um, big fan of their aesthetic, big fan of their design, of course. Um, it's a little pricey, uh, but I really have found that this is like the best toaster I've ever had in my life. So take that for what, it, what it's worth. Kirstie, I would love to show you, but... I don't know that I could time it correctly because see, we're looking this way. I know I was thinking about it and that is sad. And I should have set that up. Um, <laughs> I really should have done that. <laughs> but I didn't think, I didn't think it through. Okay. But I really recommend this toaster. It's super, super great. It's really cute. The four slice is the way to go. There's also a two slice one. So you can click through and you can also look for a two slice one. I really think four slices is the way to go. Um, but maybe that's just because there are three people in, in my house who like sometimes want toast at the same time. <laughs> also, usually my husband is the one ma making toast and he really likes this toaster as well. So it's not just me being like, it's aesthetically pleasing. It's like also like a super great toaster. Um, yes. Oh my God. No, it's actually really great. That's a really good point, Chrissy. It's really great for just like big slices of bread too. Um, which is what I do like about it. Like it's actually very, very, very helpful for that. Um, okay. Let me go through. Okay. I'm really excited about these. These are some towels that I got recently. Um, they're by overexposed. They're just so cute. I mean, look at them. They're super, super cute with the deal with the live stream. It's 4165. Um, I live in LA. So you always have beach towels on you. <laughs> That's like a thing no one tells you about LA is that like you move to LA and you just like carry beach chairs around with you and beach towels all the time because you're like, what if I go to the beach? Like I might need that. But so I finally, you know how beach towels just kind of like accumulate? Like I feel like I never made a decision to get a beach towel before like it was just like when I was growing up it would just be random beach towels that like people gave us because like they went on a trip or like I got a beach towel because I was on a trip to Corsica you know like it's just like random like that and these are like so cute I love these they feel really nice and it's just like I only got two of them but it's just really I really like them just to kind of like bring everywhere. We take my son to swim class every Saturday. And so now these are the towels that I bring to swim class um, every week. I just think the pattern is really cool. It feels really nice. And I feel like this is like the kind of thing as a gift where it's just kind of like everyone needs beach towels and these like look nice. And if they're not like unfolded by me, like <laughs> they fold up really nicely and you could like really give someone like a really nice, a really nice gift of this. They're also like decently sized. I hate when I get towels of any kind where it's like, they're kind of small. Like these are like really nice. Um, thank you, Eric, right? They like look really good. They're just a really nice, just sort of cotton beach towel. Like there's nothing fancy going on. It's just like a really cute design and a really cute, um, really cute towel. Um, so I have these, it's pretty big. I mean, here, it's on the floor now. 
and it comes up to here on me. And I'm 5'4". So it's like a pretty good sized beach towel. Um, I have two of these. Absolutely love them. Like, I really like, my goal with this is that this live stream is filled with like a lot of stuff that makes good gifts, a lot of stuff that makes good gifts for yourself. <laughs> Cause I feel like it's all the same. Like, it's like, it's all the same thing. It's like, get gifts for other people, get gifts for yourself. Everybody have a great time. Um, so those are my beach towels, which I love. Um, and then I have another set of towels that I am obsessed with. I'm going to show you those first. And then because they're out of stock, I have a backup towel to show you. So the, these are the towels that I actually have. They're by Etitude. Um, this is the waffle towel set. So it comes with three towels, like a washcloth, a hand towel, and then like a big towel. It's this really nice like waffle material. I love these, but this set is sold out. Okay. Um, this is just like, I've talked about these on streams before, but it just makes you feel like you're in a spa. There's a little hook loop to go on your hook. These look like this all jumbled because I had to pull them off my bathroom door to come down and show you. Uh, <laughs> so it's like, I'm actively using these all the time. If I actually showed you, you would see that I like wash my face <laughs> with them. They need to be washed soon. Okay. But what I have since these are sold out is attitude has these waffle bath towel, which I assume is the same like waffle material as this, which I really, really like. So this is the bath towel version of the set that I have, right? It's real big. And it's just kind of nice, right? Like it's just a waffle set. It's kind of stretchy, really, really nice. So this waffle bath towel it's going to be um, the same idea. It's the same company. It's just the exact one that I have is um, out of stock. Eric, I do not know when it's going to be in stock again. But if you go to the um, product page of that, you should be able to sign up for alerts um, or shop this waffle bath towel because I think it's the same. It just doesn't come with the two other towels that this one has. Um, and then one other thing, which I think is going to be similar is the Etitude Waffle Bathrobe. I'm telling you, I really like this like waffle feeling. I really like the waffle of this Etitude towel. Really enjoy the set that I have. Um, I really recommend checking out um, the other Etitude products that are the waffle, um, cause that's what I can speak about. Um, so there's this bathrobe that I'm presenting right now. And then I just presented um, just the waffle bath towel. If you go to the four squares under the heart, in this live, you can see all the products that I have pinned today. So even if you missed something um, from the beginning, like the very first thing I talked about was a piece of shapewear um, that I really like, you can like go check out everything um, that's in my live all at once. See, because this live is like products from all around my house, nothing is like where it actually usually lives. So everything is just kind of like scattered. So I'm not sure, I'm not getting to show you specifically how I keep these towels in my, in my bathroom, but you can imagine it. You can just imagine it. I'm kicking off my slippers. That's how serious we're getting right now. Um, okay. While we're in this bath set, I just want to share these no crease clips. These I love. I love these so much. They're PS by Danielle. Okay. So Danielle is a, um, hairstyle, a celebrity hairstylist. And she has this product line. All of her products are great that I've tried. These no crease hair clips though are like next level. Now, my hair is back in a hat right now, so I can't show you this, but my hair always gets creases in it. Like, you know, those hair ties where they're like, no crease hair ties. No, my hair literally gets creases in it. Like if I look on 23 Me, it says like, your hair is likely to get creases in it. I'm like, that's correct. It does. These, I swear. I put it in my hair, I have curtain bangs. I pin my bangs back if I'm like putting on makeup for this. <laughs> this is the only reason I put makeup on. I use these, there's no crease in my hair. It's like magic, I don't understand how it works. Um, so this is the set that it comes with. I really like the color line. I mean, the colors literally match everything that I'm wearing right now. Um, I really like the colors of these. And I just feel like this is like the cutest like stocking stuffer. 
like it comes I don't have the packaging anymore because I use these all the time um but it comes in like a little you know case with all of them I think it's just really cute as like a little gift little stocking stuffer throw some of these in and just have fun because like everyone needs little clips like these and they're so cute they're just the best and then this part is just like you know kind of a rubber but it's not it's not that rubber hair clip where it feels like it's it gets stuck in your hair like this doesn't at all I don't know how to describe it to you but it's just like completely smooth it's not sticky or anything um so it's just really nice it's like the only thing that I've ever used that claims to be no crease and actually is um silicone might be the word I don't know you know how there are some where it's like it feels sticky this isn't sticky this is just just smooth I don't know if that's makes any sense okay um really recommend gifts stocking stuffers just have a great time um speaking of stocking stuffers wow I didn't even plan that oh <sighs> I should have but I didn't um okay so I just got this from ready set jet this is super cute so they have a few different um batons like this and it's so amazing because you can literally just this is the packaging okay and then each side is something different so the one i got is called the hydrate and glow oh it says it right here i'm stupid hydrate and glow beauty baton um but they have ones that have like um like blush and stuff and this is like this side is a face balm and then this side is a skin slash face scrub so literally like you can just get like each side it's like those like pens that you used to have as a kid so this side this is a scrub so if you want to like exfoliate your lips or something like you can use that and then when it's done you can literally like get refills to like pop the whole thing out and like get just the the end of it it's amazing it's so cool and then this is like the face balm side so this is like a hydrating thing I just think this is so cute it's a little expensive for a stocking stuffer I don't know how how expensive you go for stocking stuffers um but I feel like it's a really great just like little holiday gift because it like it's just such cute packaging it's such a cute idea and it's just kind of like who doesn't need this I keep saying that but it's literally true like it's just like this is so cute I just love I love stuff that's useful and also like adorable like you get this and you're like oh wow this is a cool thing I've never heard of this before like thank you so much I love this you know what I mean like I just really like I really like stuff like that you can check out the other kinds um that they have from ready set jet it's just it's really cute with this live stream deal it's 27 dollars um again like that might be too much for a a um stocking stuffer for you but just a cute, like, little gift. Like, thinking about you, you need a beauty baton. I don't know if you should phrase it that way, but you know what I'm saying. Um, and then the last thing in this category, before I start lighting some matches, is this Smith & Colt Hydro Gloss. This, look, with the deal at $17. Again, is that pricey for a stocking stuffer? I don't know. But I really like this lip gloss. I talked about it before. Um, the one that I have is Dusty Moth. Um, there's a bunch of different ones. It's really nice, really glossy, not sticky at all. It just feels like great. It has like a little bit of a scent to it, but like not a bad scent, like just kind of like a scent. And you can see it's just kind of glossy and mauvey. It's really nice. Um, really recommend it. I just think the packaging is so nice. It's just so cute and sleek and it just like looks like you tried something. I think I actually literally might get this for a bunch of people. Sorry if anyone's watching. Um, I think, I think this might be my go-to like present for people because I really, I really, really like it. And I just think it like looks nice. And it's like, oh, what is this? Hydro gloss? That sounds fancy. You know, like it's just kind of like a nice, a nice little gift. Um, okay, now we're gonna light some candles. Okay. Here's this. 
So this is the Easton Studio, from the Easton Studio line. These are the vintage inspired candlesticks. Ah, I love these. I love candles. I like only recently got into candles like in 2020. Like I would always get candles as gifts and I kind of like was like, I don't know what to do with this. I'm home all the time now, um, especially in 2020. And I'm just like, yeah, okay, I need a candle. My desk literally is like lined with candles. There's so many candles on the mantle. I can't even tell you. Um, there's four. And then usually these candlesticks are up there too. <laughs> so it's a lot. Um, I'll probably pull these off for Thanksgiving. I just love the look of these. I love anything. You can probably tell. But I love like vintage inspired things. Like I love things that look like retro -y, vintage -y, um, That kind of stuff. And I just really love these. I just think they're like easy. You don't have to like worry about them. Like. <laughs> Cause they're not family heirlooms. They're just like really cute candles. Um, and I just, I really, 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 really like them. Just think they're great. Um, comes in a set of two. And then with the discount, it's $69.70. Um, and then let me just show you this other candle I have. So this is the ceramic jar candle. Ah, um, this one is tunneling and I haven't fixed it yet don't judge me just leave me be um I love a candle with a lid um I just think it looks really nice it works so well as a gift and I'll let you know that like people have been buying these I made a few posts with these a while ago and I've gotten like a lot of people buying these from this so this is like a hot ticket item right now as far as like getting these candles really recommend I just think they're so cute this one, there's like a ton of different designs. Um, and it's just kind of like, just like a nice candle scent. Like it's not, you know, it's just like a nice gift, nice candle scent. Just like, what do you care? You know what? This one is usually on the mantle too. There's literally, yeah, this one's usually on the mantle too. So there's just, there's a, there's candles, candles coming from everywhere. And then with a candle, I have to show you this. Okay. My grandparents used to have a candle snuffer and I thought it was like the coolest thing I've ever seen. It was probably something like this. It was just like a random, a random purchase, like a random candle snuffer. Like I'm sure it wasn't like actually like, I don't know, super, this feels very religious. Um, <clears throat> I'm sure it wasn't actually like some family heirloom, but I like, so I like have grown up thinking that candle snuffers are like one of the fanciest things you can own. When I saw this one, I was just like, oh, I have to get this. Like, this is the best thing I've ever seen. So if you don't know, a candle snuffer is literally so you can go and snuff the candle. I mean, it's just amazing. I love this so much. It like has a nice weight to it, like where it doesn't feel, it doesn't feel cheap. Um, I really love this. This also lives on my mantle. Almost everything lives on the mantle behind me, okay? I'm just going to be real with you. Um, so much of it lives on the mantle. But it's just, like, really nice. It's a really nice little little candle snuffer. I love it so much. Um, there's one thing I want to show you. I'm going to present it, and then I'm going to run and get it because I forgot to get it, okay? BRB. Okay. I love making pies. This, don't judge me. All of my stuff is being used currently in my home. That's why it all needs to be cleaned. Um, but this is just a little pie server. I just think this is like a really nice thing. Like if you're going to someone's house for Thanksgiving, if you're bringing a pie, like bring this pie server. If you're like, you know that someone like bakes all the time, gift them a pie server. Like that's so nice. My friend like gave me like a pie carrying basket last year for Christmas. And I was like, this is the greatest thing I've ever had. Like just stuff like this. I feel like home items like this that like just look nice are such great gifts. And like, you should just always do them. So I have some like spoons in there, like a knife set, like just any home items. I just feel like work as a present, um, work as a present. Once you're like living on your own and doing stuff like, all of this kind of stuff is great. 
Um, and then, of course, we have to discuss these. So this is the Firm Living Ripple Wine Glasses. Um, all of the, like, Ripple set of Firm Living always sells out super crazy. Um, it's so cute, so you get why. Um, I got them in smoke, so it comes with a set of two. I just really like these. I usually like just stemless wine glasses, but I like this as an in-between because it has a little stem, so it, like, feels fancy, but it's still not, like, I'm sitting here. We have three cats and, like, a toddler. Like, I can't have, like, a giant <laughs> stemmed wine glass. Like, it's just, it's just crazy for everybody, but I just feel like these are so cute. Again, such a great gift. Just, like, such a perfect gift. You know, just cute little glasses. You can also get them in clear, um, I think. And then, um, yeah, it's just a set of two. It's like, what more do you need? You just need that. I'm going to put them away if I can. Because I'm always worried I'm going to break everything. Constantly worried about that. Um, let me see. Yeah, so that is it. I know I really powered through that. So thank you so much. <laughs> I just felt really passionately about each of these things. And I was just like, I have to get them all into this live stream. Like, I just really, this is all stuff I really like. Um, some stuff that I've had for forever. The Smeg Toaster, I like super, super, super highly recommend. I love it so much. Um, let me know before I leave if there's anything you want me to present um, again or talk about. Um, I went through so much different stuff. Ooh, shapewear. Um, we had storage containers. We have rainbow bowls. We've got a candle snuffer. Two different candle things. Uh, a pie server. Beach towels. Bath towels. A beauty baton. A lip gloss. Hair clips. So much stuff. Um, does anyone have any last questions um, about anything? You can always review all the stuff that I covered um, in the little four dots. Um, and just remember the attitude stuff is um, the attitude that I have is sold out, but you can buy similar like towels and robes and stuff with the waffle set. Um, those are all available. Um, let me know if there's anything you want me to present again. Otherwise I'm gonna jump off in a sec and yeah, I think that's it. These these things I don't have. I just think they're really cute. Um, just a little spoon set, a little spoon set, and then a little cheese knife set. Adorable. I'm like, who doesn't like those? Um, I'm probably going to do probably the rest of my streams, like through the end of the year, are going to be really like gift focused, like stuff for gifts, stuff for gifting. Um, so let me know. And um, I try to go Thursdays or Fridays. I probably won't go next Thursday. That's in Thanksgiving. Um, but <laughs> I'll probably jump on on Friday. Um, so you can join me again there. Um, follow me on the Bear Shop app at Erin. And um, you can uh, check out when I'm going to do other streams. Does anyone need anything else? I love the diamonds. Thank you. What if I was doing them for myself? Like you can't see this hand. Cause I'm over here like tapping, like those hearts are from me. Do you know that? Uh, <laughs> what if I just did that for myself the whole time? I think that would be fun. Oh, you can tell my camera's shaking. Whatever. <laughs> I like the hand claps. Thank you. Um, okay. Um, if no one has any questions, I'm going to leave. Sorry that I went through so many things. I just felt really passionate about it. Um, and hope you have a good time, um, shopping. Um, I was just jumping off. I see a couple of people are joining. Um, please check out all the stuff, um, in here. If you have anything that you want me to talk about, uh, quickly, please let me know, leave me a comment and let me know, and I will get back into it. Otherwise I'm going to leave just because I talked a mile a minute for you guys. And I am sorry about that. I can't stop doing that. I don't know what's the matter with me. Um, <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Um, okay, so I will um, probably see you next week. 
um, on Friday, which is Black Friday. So come back then. I told you it's a habit. I can't stop doing it. Okay. Bye.